so tired of this and it seems it's disconnecting my, my keyboard. And flipping, I don't know why it's doing this. But I will try to record this video five times and stop working. But anyway, today we're gonna be talking about that stuff that happened today. I already made a video of it and I'm making this part two because my thing ran out of storage. Yeah. Um So, basically where I left was I said I am not interested that much in other videos. Now, um, okay. Emma, she seems like a nice person, and if Emma was ever in the state, I think I said this in my last video, I don't know. That I made about this a few minutes ago. It may be up. I don't know. Let me check. No, it's not up yet. I'm going to make it, like, you know, uploads. So this won't be confusing. <sighs> okay. So if Eva was ever in the state, no, no matter what happened, if they got married, whatever, if she was in the state where she didn't want to be with Frank anymore, she would be scared. She would be like, I'm afraid to leave Frank. Because I don't believe they're in that state. Now Frank, he tries to keep positive, positive, whatever. Um, but, but like a few problems I have had with him is I've seen things where he has blocked people, and I'm not talking about the spin the bottle cap or whatever thing where you you, you bought where if it lands on tails or whatever, you get blocked. That that's just stupid. Like why would you do that to your fans? Why would you do that to people who love you? And not of course his fans are that toxic, so um, but I've seen people post pictures where he's blocked them. That's just sad, man. Like that's actually sad. If you're going to do that to people who love you, then that's sad. And I mean I'm not lying because there's a person on Instagram. Um I I'm gonna leave their username in the description, maybe, because they posted something a long time ago. You may have to scroll through their pictures, but they posted it where Frank blocked them. No reason. No actual reason. Okay, what Richie said was stupid, okay? How, a little bit of it was stupid, what he said, Frank did bad things, I don't know. I agree with a lot of things he has said, like, Frank is going to come after your Richie and say he has mental problems, okay? Well, Richie does not have a lying problem because he doesn't, okay? And I'm not going to be like, oh my god, like Richie is such an amazing person because I watch his content. Oh my god, Frank, shut up. You're so dumb. <laughs> no. Um, I, I'm not going to be like that. I'm going to disagree with some things that he has said. And that, that's, that's fine. Everybody does that unless they are, uh, a toxic fan. Uh, if they're, like, toxic in the fan base. And when you're a toxic fan, basically, you have to agree with everything they say except with the person that you're in the fandom uh, like, for example, 21 Pilots, there's a lot of toxic fans, and they agree with everything Tyler and Josh say, and then people who don't agree with them that are still in the fandom, you're a fake fan, you, you know, whatever, and, and then they're coming after Tyler and Josh, whatever, they don't have anything to do with it, but, 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 this is my point right here, this one just makes me so mad at, and disappointed in Frank and Eva. Um, okay, if Frank and Eva were actually happy, which they probably are, but they probably have some problems at least, because there's no relationship where you have problems. But if they were happy, why would they be so choked up about this? And why would they be so emotional? Like I said, Frank, I mean, with Angeline, she wasn't that emotional in this. Um, Fr Frank, he was actually crying, which kind of made me cry. And 
I, I was crying when I seen the video that Richie made. I, I just seen the thumbnail and I started crying. Um, good morning. Oh my god. Um, but, but I was crying and, and that's okay. But Evangeline, it didn't really make me cry when I seen her video because she wasn't making that much emotional stuff. And I'm not going to say that Richie is seeking attention, but I think to, to say that Frank was being bad Java is it, kind of seeking attention. Yet Frank could have easily said that um, to Richie that I don't want to do videos with you because I'm disappointed in you and you, you know, cheated on Jacqueline, whatever. He, he did bad things to Jacqueline, okay? He, he could have easily said that to Richie, and then I would be. I would be a lot happier with Frank. I'd be like, okay, well, well, that's okay. But then, they are happily together. Why would they be so choking up? Choked up about this? Why? Like, it's almost as if Frank was afraid that Eva was going to agree with a few things Richie said. And it's almost as if Eva was going to unleash a secret that they had together that he had done something at least that time. Um, and it's almost as if, like, Eva didn't show emotion because she she was um, kind of going through what Richie said, even though I said it was a stupid statement that he shouldn't have made. Um, and all in all, that's their business, really. But, but I agree because he should, if Frank was doing that, he may or may not be, I don't know, just because I seen, like, Frank showing emotion because he was afraid his younger audience, which isn't that mature, um, is going to come after him, it doesn't mean that it's true. I'm just saying that. Really, this is just. And then, okay. I'm not saying that it's not Richie's business, but it isn't his business because they hadn't talked in a long time. Now, if he was currently talking to Frank, then it would kind of be his business a little bit. But, but you know, if he was doing things bad to Eva, then Richie would have to jump in and talk about it a little bit. Because that would be, like, kind of saving her. But, of course, if he was, then she would be fake about it. And that's all I'm going to say for this. And if you don't agree with me, then that's okay. Because I don't care. Um, 